Hello everyone, welcome back to day 21 of the Iguana Milling Challenge. Happy New Year, hope everyone had a fun and safe time. I haven't checked in on Monday or Tuesday as our year has started off crazy busy. So a good thing, hope the same for you. But as you can see, the tool is still milling. We're now at over 440 hours, so everyone on our side is extremely happy. Now, I'm checking in late today because if you watched in the stream previously, w every time we tried to mill the head design, so our partners, that's the coolant supplier, is when we had the mistakes. So first was the water supply issue on the, to the machine, and second was a programming mistake when the coin flipped over, the arm was at the wrong angle. So twice we've tried to mill this design, twice we've failed, and a third time is the charm. Uh, got through it, moved on to Lang Technik. That's now our 20th coin that we started milling. And we're back on track. So every partner has at least one coin. We're going through milling the other partner designs. And we're just going to see uh, if we can get through the week. Now, initially we had planned on using the machine. So this machine is used for projects inside of Tsesha, of course. Um, so we thought, okay, if we did a design, uh, an event like this, then we do it during Christmas break and New Year's where they're on vacation anyways, there's not a lot going on. And then this first week of January, uh, tomorrow and Friday, Sesha are closed, uh, production's open on Friday, but tomorrow's a holiday in parts of Germany. So they're closed and we said, okay, if it holds through Christmas, New Year's, we'll let it run the first week. Um, and then on the 10th, we were going to mill our last design and then check out the tool and, and see how it looks like. For the closing though, we need, if you watch the opening, we have an external third party to confirm that this is the same tool that we put in the machine. In addition to you being able to watch a live stream to make sure nothing was changed out the entire time. And that's the uh, Professor Dr. Zoy and he has to be there for the closing and he cannot make it on the 10th. So we're in discussions right now of when he can be there because uh, we want him to be the one to take it out of the machine, take a look. We'll go through a bunch, we'll put everything online. So pictures from the start of the event, how the tool looked like at the end, how the service finishes from the first to last coin look, everything. Um, so we want him to be there for that, and we're going to find out in the next couple of days how that's going. We also have several other announcements coming up in the next days, so stay tuned for that. For now, uh, I got to head home. So enjoy the stream. Talk to you tomorrow. Bye.